Hello everyone, I am Prem Kumar. Welcome to Vertex Olympiad Math. Today we are going to discuss very interesting Olympiad based question. You can see here x and y are positive integers such that 7 times x power 5 is equal to 11 times y power 13 and the minimum possible values of x has the prime factorization given. So what is the value of a plus b plus c plus d? So what we can do 7 times x power 5 is equal to 11 times y power 13 is given to you. You can see the left side is 7 is there, right side also 11 is there. So if you choose other than 7 and 11 for x, it will be larger number. We need smallest x value. For that x must be multiple of 7 and 11 only. So you can see here 7 power c and 11 power d you can take. It's a prime factorization. So y how to write? The so 7 power m and 11 power n you can write. Now you can substitute everything here. 7 times 7 times c 11 times d whole power 5 is equal to 11 times what's y? 7 power m 11 power n whole power 13. Now you can simplify this. The base are same adding the power. 7 power 5c plus 1 11 power 5 5D. You can see here right side 11 power 13n plus 1 and 7 power 13m. Now you can see when these exponentials are equal here, when the powers will be equated, right? A power m is equal to a power n if and only if m is equal to n. So you compare the power of the exponent 5c plus 1 is equal to 13m. 5 times d is equal to 13 times n plus 1. So from this, what we conclude here, when you write in terms of congruence, it will be easy for you. So that means 5c plus 1 is congruent to 0 modulo 13 because remainder here is 0. 5d minus 1 is equal to 13 times n. So that means 5d minus 1 is congruent to 0 modulo 13. Then how to rewrite this one? 5c is congruent to minus 1 modulo 13 and second one so 5d is equal to 1 modulo 13 we can write. Just adding 1 both sides. Modulo 13. Now which values of c you can take show that when you divide it by 13 you will get minus 1 is the remainder. So if you put here c is 5 so 5 into 5 is 25 when you divide by 13, the remainder is minus 1. Here, which values of d you can take? You can put here d is equal to 8. So 5 into 8, it is 40. When you divide by 13, remainder is 1. So therefore, this is only possible. Therefore, here, x in the form of a power c, b power d. So here, a is 7, b is 11. Therefore, a plus b plus c plus d is equal to, what is a here? 7, b is 11, b is 5, d is 8. If you add all the things, you will get 31 is your answer. Why we are choosing x in terms of 7 and 11? prime powers. The reason is if you take more than that other than 7 and 11 it will be increased the number. We need the minimize the x value. That's why we are choosing the number. You can see here 7 power 11 power we are writing so that it will be equated. It should be a minimum possibility. I hope everyone understand. If you like this video please subscribe my channel Vertex Volume VRs and share to your friends. Thank you everyone.